Hello and welcome, ladies and gentlemen. In this video, I am going to show you that implementing phone number verification is actually not hard, and that you can do it in just a few lines of code. All the code that I'll be using is readily available in the GitHub repository linked in the description. We will be upgrading this basic registration form by adding a page where we will prompt the user to enter the code he received in an SMS. On the back end, we'll add an endpoint for sending phone numbers for verification and modify the register endpoint to include the verification code. Without further ado, let's take a look at the initial code. On the back end side of our application, we have this Express app with one endpoint that you can send the HTTP POST request to, which just stores the user in the local JavaScript dictionary. On the front end, we have a registration form that sends a request to that endpoint. And if the registration is successful, it just navigates to dashboard using the React Router Navigate hook. If there's anything that you're unsure about or you'd like a deeper explanation, feel free to ask in the comments section. The first step is to create a new page and add it to the React Router. We'll start by creating a new file called Verification Form JS. This will be our screen. We'll take the layout of the registration form and give it a little tweak. Now let's add a new page to the router in the app.js. Next, we'll create the logic for communication with the server. In the registration form, we'll pass all the form data to the verification page. And instead of sending a post request to the register endpoint, we'll use the verify endpoint, which we will be creating in a second, and send just the phone number. On the verify page, we'll send a register request with all the form data, including the code. And with that, the mobile app is done. Let's switch to the server. First things first, we'll need to register with TextLink and get an API key, which we can use to send free testing messages. To do this, follow the link in the description. The registration process is simple. Just sign in with Google. Once we have our account set up, we'll copy our API key for later use. Next, we'll create the verify endpoint where we will send a verification SMS. To send a verification code and check if the code entered by the user is valid, we'll need to install the TextLink SMS Node.js package, which can be downloaded using NPM. With the package installed, we'll add the new Verify endpoint and implement it. Firstly, we need to initialize the TextLink library with the API key that we have stored a moment ago. Next, we will simply call the Verify function provided in the TextLink package, which sends the code to the provided phone number. We need to await the response of the verify function, so our verify handler should be asynchronous. Finally, we'll modify the register endpoint to accept the code, check if it's valid, and proceed only if it is. And that is all, let's see if it works. I am first going to try it with the invalid code. Okay, now I will enter the valid code. Great, it is working and that's all for today's tutorial. If you have any questions or the suggestion for the future videos, don't hesitate to let me know in the comments. Until next time, see you.